Hello and welcome. This is your coffee lover. Today, we are here to talk about one of the most crucial aspects of espresso making, how to set to perfection the coffee grinder. Take your time, follow me, and let's go over the rules on how to best set up a coffee grinder. We will start by setting the size on the grinder gear. But first, we have to pour the coffee beans inside the grinder. Then, it is time to set the grinding level on the grinding gear. I am now going to grind the first batch of beans. Three grinding cycles will allow us to fine-tune the grinder and reach the perfect size. First cycle. Second cycle. And third cycle. Now our grinder is ready and set, and we will grind at the desired size. Let's now test our coffee grinds. So, we are going to see three different types of coffee grinds. In the first filter, we have a level 2 ground coffee. This coffee will come out burnt as water will not be able to go through the filter panel. In the second filter holder, we have a level 6 ground coffee, and this is the grind set to get a correct espresso. While in the third filter holder, we find very rough grind of grade 9. These will allow the water to pass too quickly through the coffee, and the result will be a very watery coffee. Now, let's test together our extractions. We will now extract our coffee with a rough grind. As we can see inside our panel, there is a lot of water going through, and this will not allow the coffee to have a very fine crema, and most of the coffee grinds won't be extracted. Now, let's try the very fine coffee grinds. The result and the cup will be completely the opposite. We will get a very very burnt coffee with a non-existent flavor bouquet. Let's purge the machine first. Now, let's insert our filter holder and extract the very fine coffee grinds. As you can see, the coffee can hardly come out. And even from the manometer itself, we can see that the hand is on the red zone. The coffee extracted is then completely burnt and contains no elements at all. Let's purge the machine. Now, let's use the coffee with the correct grain size. And as we extract it, we can notice that this is a proper espresso, with the right organoleptic properties, a nicely formed crema, and all the properties that make a coffee a great espresso.
And here you can see the difference among the three different types of grind. Which one would you choose? Well, I don't compromise. I only go for a properly made espresso. How about you?